Hello, I am Corey, the owner of Fork and Fly. Come and travel and eat with me. Guess what? You want to learn how to make something? Stay tuned if you want to learn how to make this keto seafood mashed cauliflower quad. Say that fast. Keto seafood mashed cauliflower quad. Stay tuned. The ingredients that you would need, I'm not gonna say the measurements because it depends on how much you're making. This mashed cauliflower, cheddar and bacon, you could use the plain one. You can use real crab if you feel like cutting up some crab legs, but I got in the bag. A lobster tail, Velveeta cheese, you can use the black cheese, but we have to shred it. Some butter, some minced garlic, some shrimp, not all of it. Today's Seafood Friday, some of it. And I'm feeling a little risky, so I think I'm gonna add some fish to the mix. Some swai. Stay tuned. Read the ingredients on your mashed cauliflower. Pop this in the microwave. Cut two slits, put it in the microwave seven minutes. We're gonna cut up our seafood. We got some shrimp. Little pieces. Piece of fish. Like I said, I'm using swai. We have our imitation crab meat. Cut this up. We have our lobster tail. This is how you, I saw a comment on somebody's food comment, whatever, about lobster. This guy was like, I've never cooked lobster before. How, do, how does it come out the, out the, the, the shell? Like, does it bake out the shell? Like, no, you have to cut it and pull it out. It doesn't just automatically come out. So take your kitchen scissors. Cut down the middle. That's about good. Eh, let's say a little more. Down to where the tail is. And then flip it over and pull it out. Gotta get tough with it. Ooh. Yeah, make sure you do this over your sink. There we go. But we're not saving the tail. So like if you were to do lobster, it will be like this. But we're taking the whole thing out. Make sure you get all that meat. Look at that. And washing meat. I'm gonna cut it up to pieces. Everything is bite sized pieces. Now, to make our seafood sauce for our mashed potatoes, we're gonna use, add some butter, add minced garlic. Medium, low heat. We have our seafood quad. <laughs> We're gonna add the fish first. And it's not a lot of everything. It's a lot of different things. Cajun, season, season it to taste. I have salted butter, so I'm not gonna salt this. Now we're gonna add our lobster. Our 
our shrimp. Then I thought about it, I thought, ooh, I should have did a live. Um, so you're catching it halfway um, through, yeah, I guess. Yeah, all the gifts are okay. I'll have some garlic. I'm making a keto seafood mashed cauliflower. If you're not doing keto, then you will use real potatoes instead of cauliflower mashed potatoes. But right now I have a quad. Usually it's like a trio, but it's a quad. We have shrimp, lobster, crab meat, and swai fish in some butter and garlic sauce with some Cajun seasoning, some garlic, and we're gonna add some pepper. Seafood doesn't take no time at all to cook. Look at this. How does that look? Mm. Oh, I forgot about my YouTube people. <laughs> Look at this. Sorry, okay, guys. So she's you, making that. You might make a and then here's my butter sauce. Add and some the oven. I got lobster tails here. I got to finish um, seasoning it. And, and then. So we have our mashed cauliflower right there. We're going to take some of our seafood mixture. Add it in. Give it a nice stir. With, with garlic. And the refrigerator. Set that aside. Come back over to our seafood mix. And we're gonna add a little bit of cherries. A little bit of cherries. Two handfuls. I've never done this before, so hopefully this Velveeta cheese tastes good with it. But it should, because it already tastes good. I did add a little bit more butter. Let's plate it up. We got our cauliflower mashed potato. Look at that. You could just eat that alone. And then we got our seafood sauce. The quad. No trio here. We got quad. Look at this. <clears throat> Pour that right on top. Yes. Garnish it with some parsley. There you have it. Who says you can't eat good on keto? Let's try this. Okay, we're gonna get into this bad boy. Whew. Let's do the cauliflower mash first. Don't forget this one has bacon in it. Now let's do it with the seafood. Seafood, this is. Mm. 
Mm. Is this really keto? Mm. 